Alright, that's us going out live for some more Everybody's Gone to the Rapture. Just give us a couple of seconds to make sure the stream's going out alright and we'll get right back into it. just now. That wouldn't anyway. Everybody's rapture doing their audio testing. One, two. <laughs> right, so I found the stream. It's nearly loaded. Right. Still in here. I think I've done this bit last night, actually. You can't save them. Just pack a case and meet me at the station. They've closed the lines. Weren't you listening to the radio? Because of the flu. There is no flu, Lizzie. Oh, Christ, Stephen, I'm not stupid. Of course there's no flu, but the stations are still closed. There's an access footpath that runs alongside the main tunnel. You can get out that way. They won't have thought of it. You know what's going on, don't you? You can't use the phone anymore. What, like you're not using one right now? Funny. Listen, just don't use the phone after this. No TV or radio either. It can hide in the signal. Oh, you make it sound like it's alive. I don't think we have a word for what it is. Just promise me, don't tell anyone. Pack quietly, meet me at the station tomorrow, all right? I feel awful lying and leaving all these people here. It was a brilliant idea about the show. Top marks for that, you clever thing. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. So I'd heard that bit last night. The wee orb went down there, but we'll go down here first. This is how I end up lost. I follow these things. And there's phones going off and I run by stuff. Hi, this is Kate Collins and Stephen Appleton. Leave a message. Stephen, it's me. I'm leaving. I've waited as long as I can. If you are there to meet me, I'm leaving for the station now, but I am going anyway, whether you're there or not. But I love you. Please be there. I 
love you. Shall we back up now? Found it like this? Yeah. I got into the habit of checking in first thing in the morning just to make sure he's had his pills. Mr. Coles is not a well man, Elizabeth. It's entirely possible he upped and wandered off. If things progressed, the mind can be a fragile thing, you know? It's just not very like him, that's all I'm saying, Doctor. He never misses the mid-morning bingo. He didn't smoke, did he? Not that I knew of. There's a funny... It's like ash. Well, that, that is odd. Reese cleaned in here yesterday afternoon. I'll have to have a word. It's not like cigarette ash. Strange. Dr. Wade, there's just been a phone call. We needed back at the village. Apparently, Mrs. Barton has disappeared. and soundtrack. Hey, Keller B. Good to see you. Cheers for tuning in. It's very kind of you. You shouldn't be smoking, you know. Not in your condition. <sighs> Stephen's fault. He got me started again. I'm not going to try and stop you, but the weather's looking pretty rough. There's a storm coming. That's what Stephen said. He said he'll meet me, but there's things he has to do first. He seems to think that all of this is connected to him. 
I don't know. I, I'm going anyway, whether he comes or not. I'm assuming Stephen has thought of a way through the quarantine. Well, he's clever. You gotta give him that. Do you trust him, though? Well, I love him. So I'd hope that was good enough. I hope so, too. Listen, if you can't get through, for whatever reason, I'm uh, getting people together at the village hall, rounding up stragglers, that sort of thing. Yeah, I've got all the campers together here, doing a show. Peter Pan. The kids love it. It'll take their minds off things. Hey, did you see that? Ah, it's been a while. Hope you had a good Christmas and New Year. Glad to hear Christmas was good at least. <laughs> this is a public service announcement for Hamilton District Council emergency measures. Road and rail closures are being implemented for our country. Mrs. Graves, John, baby Dylan, is he alright? He's fine. Dai, come on. It's okay. Let's get you a cup of tea. Oh, Mrs. Graves, I need to tell you. Leave it, Dai. Try and get out of the valley, all the roads are shut. I oh, know, I was driving really fast, but the other car was on the wrong side of the road, and oh god, I think Dave, he... for fuck's sake, leave it. It's all right. Hey, you're all right. Sean's all right, baby Dylan's all right. That is what matters. Everyone's all right. <laughs> but no, now I need your help. Some of the children, they're getting quite frightened. So Rachel and I, we decided to push forward the show, keep them occupied. You said the other night you play piano. Can you help with that? Yes, yes, I suppose so. But Mr. Graves, Rob... Can look after himself. He's a big boy now. Don't worry. Just head to the hall and find Rachel. She'll tell you what needs practicing. OK, thank you, Mrs. Graves. And yeah, Sean, you. go and find Reese, please. See if he needs some help. Yeah, of course. Go on. Oh, Robert. Yeah, this is a strange one. It's quite interesting. Really lovely, though. Visually, the story's quite heavy. Uh, it looks and sounds look very, very nice indeed. Yep. Ah, uh, it really is. Good to see you, Nippon. How you doing, man? Everybody's gone to the rapture.
it's raining here as well. <laughs> oh, in the game or in real life? No, no I haven't. I was in again today and we said that it might be because it doesn't change over on the weekend. So if it's not working tomorrow I'll be in again. <laughs> yep. Look at that. I kind of wish I could go out and have a shot at that. The water bike. Hopefully I'll get it fixed. Better be fixed tomorrow, I'll right? well, be near where we be. Hello, Catherine. It's Kate. Elizabeth? Lizzie. I heard a lot about you. It's good, you know, you and Emma, it's not difficult or anything. Should it be? I'm sorry? You said it wasn't difficult. I don't see why it would be difficult. You and Stephen were together a long time ago, he moved away. Certainly isn't difficult for me. I I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend you or... No, I'm not offended. Listen, Elizabeth... But I... Lizzie, please. <laughs> Lizzie. Right. You seem like an okay type of person. And I'm not trying to be rude, I promise. But let's try and be realistic here, huh? Let's, um... Try and do our best. It's a British thing, right? Yeah, yeah. I suppose it is. We'll do our best then. <laughs> Aye, everybody's away to the rapture, weren't they? Apparently. <laughs> right, listen, I've got hundreds of pals. Blessed, blessed with loads of friends. Check all of these. <laughs> Did that one? <laughs> right. I'll get it together. Everyone's got me on edge that here the inside. Passages of music constantly makes me think something's gonna happen. Operating together, and I've got the reception up to the red zone, but it's not enough. 
I'm going to try and route the signal through Tower 6 to create a singular point of reception and re-coordinate the optical array, which should, in theory, focus a signal spike on the point of origin. If I conceptualize this origin point as a seventh tower, then it makes a kind of sense. Kind of. I think we're moving so far beyond everything I understand about physics. Anyway, it's got to be worth a shot. I the air raid siren. There was dialogue about a character that had stolen an old air raid siren. I need to pay attention to where I'm going. <laughs> this is a, it's a big place. to the same bat, isn't it? Yeah. This is a public service announcement from Haberton District Council Emergency Measures Committee. Road and rail closures are being implemented to help contain the outbreak of injuries, head teachers, scoutmasters, masters, and members of the clergy will act as your representatives. Be sure to report any symptoms of illness. hyper. <laughs> I'm just on edge in this. It's quite, it's really nice but it's the music and stuff um, and the story is very unsettling. It's like, it's like very sort of oh, I just feel with the music. There's a lot of ambient stuff as well. today always gives me grief and I managed the last 10 years so you're a little late for the knight in shining armor routine suit yourself I'm only trying to help god damn it Stephen I'm not some useless sappy girl that you can just string along forever look around you I made all of this I built it on my own when everyone else had written me off as some poor little cripple you know that's not how I see you well you weren't there were you You'd given up on me long before the accident. What do you want from me, Lizzie? I love you. I'll do anything. Anything except okay? I thought not. I love you too, but sometimes I think you just say what you think everyone else wants to hear. Oh, I'm understanding. <laughs> <laughs> is that it rains every 40 seconds. Yeah. That is very stressy. I was uh, 
good, but harrowing dialogue back then. Right. Let's try and get back towards that roundabout. <laughs> Just keep an eye on where I am here. And so I'm there. Yeah, there's a lot of the air raid side. I will go this way, right? <laughs> I'll hope that it's the right way. No, oh, I feel like I've seen that before. Does that mean that I'm close to the end of it? So that was the pill. Laundry, main hall. It's just around a bit. Service announcement from Hamilton District Council Emergency Measures Committee. Road and rail closures are being implemented to help contain the outbreak of influenza. Please remain calm and indoors. Local community leaders, head teachers, scoutmasters, and members of the clergy will act as your representatives during this period. But be sure to report any symptoms of illness. That isn't going anywhere, is it? No. <laughs> eh. I feel like... Something maybe is supposed to trigger in here. <laughs> I can't. I can't jump. I can jump sometimes. I'm going to try all the buttons again just to make sure I can't. I tried this door. It's weird. I can't fly. <laughs> right, so we'll go to laundry. We'll work our way back. Maybe I went there first? I've came back up the other road. Let's see where this goes. Hey Sparky, good to see you. Not a true seagull till you fly. <laughs> Seagull. Oi, Shipley, I want a word with you. What? Get over here, soft lad, and keep your voice down. Do you know who I am? Yeah. You work for Meg Holloway? 
Charlie Tate. You can call me Charlie. What's this about, Charlie? Rachel Baker. What about her? Oh, come on, son. I wasn't born yesterday. Are you looking to get your head kicked in? She's 16. She's not a kid. You try telling her dad that. He'll bloody kill you. I love her, though. You can't stop love. I'm not telling you to stop anything. Just be careful, that's all. Hope you had a good uh, Christmas and New Year. It's far key. It's been a wee while. It was a bit wait getting a bit waiter getting back than I think I'd said on the, the message. <laughs> but it's really good. Yeah, it's it has been pretty good. Didn't he? I got Super Beat Zonic and Eve Valkyrie for Christmas. It was, it was really good then. Thanks, it was really good. It's a funny shape. Is it sore? I can't feel it at all. Don't fuss over it. I can't believe that you left Kate there. Why won't you tell me what happened? She's probably not even noticed I've gone. Uh, it's really nothing. You're lying. Don't lie to me. Fine. We had a row. She'll work all night anyway. Stephen, listen to me. Was there an accident? Is that how your face got burnt? It's nothing. Something, I don't know. Just got a bit shaken up and then we fought. She wanted to stay and collect more data. Was she burnt as well? Is everything all right? Jesus, Liz, are you sleeping with me or her? She's fine, we're both fine. I don't want to talk about her. I came here to see you. I just worry... Well, you. don't. Come to bed. <laughs> what is the the cacti? Is that multiple cactuses? Cacti. What is a cacti? <laughs> Did I say it right the first time? Right, hold on. And the music's all lovely. And I'm not sure if I should be following that thing. I'm not sure if. Cacti. <laughs> have like seven and one. I don't understand. I never said that to no cacti. <laughs> right, roundabout's back there. Remember that. You're marrying it. No, I'm not. <laughs> hasn't even been discussed. Uh, about when it comes to cacti, what is happening in the chat here? <laughs> what is <laughs> Where am I? There I am. By the tennis. Right, on that other map there was sort of infinity squiggles on some of the things. 
and one of them is that caravan up at number six. Or was it number five? Is it there's a radio very close? I don't even care that he was screwing her. What made me angry was that he treated me like I was too stupid to notice. I dream through the light storm and see the pattern dancing on his skin as he burns. I wake up with eyes full of liquid light. I'm going to concentrate all five remaining towers on the same point in the sky. If it is establishing conduits for communication, that should create a jump in bandwidth. Uh, yeah, pretty much Sparky actually. I think it was the Chinese room that made it. And uh, I think they made Dear Esther. I meant to look that up. Tennis is off. <laughs> it's really nice. I, I thought it was. It was instant. I know that's no help. Can you leave me alone? There was nothing we could do. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, Pat. Oh, you've woken the baby. Just leave me alone. Rachel, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Right. Cool. Tears need fun. I meant to check that. Because I think I said that last time. <laughs> and then I never checked. That's bad practice. I'm not eavesdropping. Everybody's gone to the rapture. I should really... Uh, it's, it's going that way, but it'll come back. Just want to check this wee shed. Just on the off chance that it that it opens. Yeah. I think that oh it says tennis is off, but I think he can get in here. Ah, is it like spirits or is it fragments of time and I don't know. All the all the clocks are all at um, six oh seven. Is that maybe a verse? Some, some verse in the paper, maybe. Something to do with the rapture. It's just been on the radio that they're closing the roads. Something about the flu. D no one here has flu, Sean. There's no flu here. I overheard Mrs. Graves, and she said another family of Upton left. She said they must have left last night, but the car and all their stuff's still here. Screw this day. That's 15 people Upton left in two days. I don't like it. Where's the baby? Asleep in a caravan. Sean, I don't want to sit around you waiting for it to get worse. I reckon if we leave now, we can get out of the valley before they get their acts together and close the roads. You think so? Yeah, we can go the back roads, through the woods. I leave some money on the side for Mrs. Graves. You know her husband isn't back yet either. He's a boozer, right? That's what I've heard. That's her problem anyway. Don't be unkind, Sean. Come on, let's go and get Dylan. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of different accents in this. Mints, months. <laughs> Introduce myself to them. Because this is so, it's, I don't know, they're in the past. Can he talk to them or help them? <laughs> what? No, that's not happening. <laughs> I'm chatting, chatting, you've misspelled. Right, we're going this way, right? Tennis is off. We'll run up here. I'm in the past. I feel like I've been down here. Hmm. 
Wait. Was that the wee caravan? Number six. Too, too many. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, that's good. I didn't think that was going to happen because it looked really detailed. Shouldn't have been impressed. But I am. Amazing. Just going to play with that bit of fabric if I get lost. Look at that 60s hair there. I'm stuck in the 60s. <laughs> it's a 60s, you wouldn't be allowed. No, well, maybe. Towards the end. Definitely been here because that door was open. <laughs> get back up to the roundabout. Get to the main hall, maybe. Give this hang a chase. That's the map that had the infinity symbol on it. He's gone up there. I get some yes on, totally. This isn't the one that had the thing. It says that like number six is like behind me. Snowdrop. <laughs> I don't know man, I think the hair, my hair's gonna go out. Get in the mode. Creepy going, <laughs> float speed into some belt. That's what's gonna happen. Look at this.
Aye. Sorry everybody. Got a wee bit into that there. I'll try and catch up with the chat. What was it you were saying? Aye, I think I think next they'll probably be like the next game uh, I'll be buying will be Gravity Rush 2. Um and Resi 7. I do, I think it I think it's gonna be good. I'm worried about uh playing the whole thing in VR though. I might do a normal playthrough and then try in VR once I kinda know what I'm doing. Six, not the strongest. Uh, I don't think I'm going to get the Resi House Collector's Edition because it was a bit. Um, it's just annoying that the game isn't there. I mean, it's cool, but I can't really, can't really justify a hundred quid on it. Maybe like once I've played the game, and depending on how big an impact it has, maybe then I'd pick it up. But. I might get the steelbook. Uh, that's like 55 quid. 55 pound for the steelbook. I think it's game exclusive. I'm gonna get. There's a. A Resident Evil 7 candle. For having on. If you're in the VR, I suppose. Supposed to smell like the house. Phone. I ran right by it. Sorry. There's data down. coming through faster than I can encode it. I've already lost two processors. They keep burning out. Please, I love you. You need to get out of there. It's not safe. I need you, Steven. I need you here. I can open the gate manually. I can let you in. It's too dangerous. You don't understand what's happening. No, here. you don't understand. We can solve this. We can find a way. I just need more power. I need to amplify the signal, and I can't do it on my own. You saw the opportunity. You ran the numbers, remember? We're responsible for all this. You and me. <laughs> it's not just you and me anymore, though, is it? Jesus, Kate, you're trying to talk to it, aren't you? Kate, you can't. Stephen, I have to. Save up money and buy a switch. Aye. Uh, probably. There's a no more heroes coming out on it, so I'll probably get one. <laughs> uh, last Resi movie is out this year. I've, no, I've missed quite a few of them. Uh, don't like VR supported swapped on the cover to VH. I mean, it's kind of, it, it I don't know, it does need to be there. I mean, it was worrying, I thought it was actually going to be sold, like, as two separate versions. And it's better that it's sold as, as sort of the one thing. What is happening? Despite how lovely it is, this game has me on edge quite a lot. <laughs> like that, I think. Sure. How close it's I should be getting. Dead. It won't start. It's only a short walk to the camp. I think we should split up. You go and fetch Rachel. I'll go back to the village and find Evie. I don't think we should split up. I don't want to either, Charlie, but we've got to. 
I'll meet you back at my house later on, okay? We can talk properly then. Why won't you tell me what happened? No, no, actually, you should stay at the camp tonight. Come find me in the morning. Bring Rachel back. She's gonna need her mother. Meg. Just take care of her. Meg! What is it, Charlie? Nothing. Just be careful, that's all. I will, I promise. You as well. I'll see you later on. That's, is that what it's called? Hey, fun. Get Ark. Oh, aye. Aye, it's got dinosaurs in it. Like it. I bet the VR thing, I mean. I don't know. It's good. I think it's good that it's there in the same package. Because it means if you've already. If you've not got it, you can play it, and if you have got it, you can play it. Like, my goodness, it's getting dark. Is it really? I didn't know that, man. Has been heroes. Aye, that's exciting. Heroes vs. Villains, Star Wars. <laughs> Phone. Where is it? In here? Oh, Yakuza Zero, that's pretty soon as well. Why on earth are you there? Why aren't you calling from home? It's hard to explain. I'm having to move around to follow it. When it finds a suitable host, it begins to amplify... Sorry, I'm not making much sense. They're talking about flu and a quarantine on the radio, but this... I know you're not that kind of doctor, but it all just sounds really weird. We don't know exactly what it is yet, but it's got something to do with the other night. Stephen, your face, the mark, do you think you're infected? It's not a disease, Lizzie. It's something else. There's something Kate said about patterns. I can't grasp it clearly yet. Okay, come over. Have some lunch. We can talk properly. Have you spoken with Kate? Oh, she's locked herself in the observatory. She's buried in the data. But it's already out here in the world. I need to see how it adapts. How what adapts? Stephen, try to explain. Time's up. Lizzie, listen. Be ready. I need to go. It's moving again. I'll call you later. Same day as Resi in Kingdom Hearts. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna have to make. Oh, what? <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I'm not gonna have time to play all of them at the same time. But I'll need to choose. It's a wee while until near. It's like March or something. Sorry, sorry everybody. Ah, <laughs> oh, snitch. Gotta go to school in the morning. No bother, cheers for tuning in. Uh, Killer B, good to see you. Right, sorry, try to sort my nose out. Lovely. Remind me of Bloodborne and occasionally outside when the sky was like that. <laughs> Disgusting, what face. Sorry, man. Sneezing right in your ears and eyes. <laughs> is that one of those? No, is it? Is it? No, no, it's not. Yeah, they're not. They're 
Nobody we know. Do you think she'll like it? It's in an awful state, Stephen. I don't It'll think so. It'll be an adventure. It'll mean putting down roots here, maybe a family. Are you sure she wants children? What, to stay here? It's not her place, you know. Don't start that again, please. I mean, she's ambitious, love, and she's, well, older. She's not going to want to stay cooped up at home looking after the kids. Is that how you felt about me? Oh, stop it, Stephen. That's not what I meant, and you know it. I'm just saying you should make a choice. If it's a family you want, well, you know how much Lizzie wants a family. Jesus, Mum, I didn't come here for marriage guidance. I just asked what you thought about a fucking house. Stephen Appleton language! Sorry, it's just that you have to understand. Kate is the most brilliant, extraordinary, wonderful person I've ever known. She's... she's like no one else. The way she looks at things. It's like she has whole worlds inside her head. I don't think you or anyone really understands that. Um, when's Persona? <laughs> I don't think I can afford. I don't think I can afford. That's that's the end of the sentence. <laughs> but I'm definitely going to play them at some point. So keep an eye out on what the. How soon is that? I feel like that's is it April, right? March, April. Right, cool. That's like a month after New Year. It's just that, like. Resi 7 Kingdom Hearts, Yakuza 0, Gravity Rush 2, that that particular part is difficult. <laughs> it's a lot. Oof. Is that what you're getting? I seen I seen the Steelbook version of Persona. I've seen a couple of different ones. <coughs> nah. time, as if I'm both speaker and listener simultaneously. I am a scientist. I can only deal with the evidence I have. And this points in one simple direction. It's not in the observatory. I like, I'm really looking forward to that. It looks sort of... There's bits of it that remind me of other Platinum games in, in a good way, like, it reminds me of Ryzen, which is an absolute blast. Bayonetta. Kate, can you hear me? Yes. 
check up this pump really quick. Come back and follow that. <laughs> you look well. I don't, but thank you. You do. How are you settling in? Nothing changes around here. I mean, it's great to be back. It still feels like home, I suppose. In a funny kind of way. It's been a long time, Stephen. Last time you saw me, I could still walk properly. You look pretty good to me. Stop it. For what it's worth, I'm sorry about how things worked out. Or didn't. Or didn't, right. Do you think you made a mistake leaving? My mum tells me it's never too late to change things, to put things right. Funny. It's just what she said to me the other day. I have been wondering what she <laughs> meant by that. That's embarrassing. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, oh, maybe I should go. Why? Stephen, we're both married. I don't think this is a good idea. What isn't? We're just two old friends having a drink, that's all. I need a taxi. <laughs> Start smashing through the houses, see if anybody's in. You know the protocol. That doesn't matter now. It's figured out how to circumvent the telecommunications blackout. What? I didn't think it could. Kate understood. She saw how adaptable it was. How smart. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're talking about it like it's alive. You have to assume that everyone here is infected. We can't know We're that. We are infected. It's killed all the birds, and now it's in us. It's trying to leave the valley any way it can. The quarantine is not enough. You've got to remove the carriers. You've got to cut off its energy source, its food. I've already told you, Stephen, I'm not going to water you an have airstrike. To. Now it knows we're onto it. It's going to keep on spreading as fast as it can. The quarantine and blackout will hold it in check. They've cut all of the phones out of the valley, so it's only you communicating Aren't out you now. you're listening? It's figured out ways around it. Radio waves, something. All of the lines are cut, but the phones are working anyway. You've done all the right things, but it's not enough. You've got to stop it before it adapts again. Stephen, my my family, my, my wife and kids. You know perfectly well what you've got to do. I can't do it. Don't ask me to do it. You're asking me to sign their death warrant, my own family. Damn it, don't you think I'm aware of that? I'll still be here when you drop the fucking stuff. Don't you lecture me about sacrifice, you spineless little shit. If you're so full of ideas, you come here and try dealing with it. Tell them the time when we had a choice is over. Tell them to do it. You've got to do it now.
story's pretty good. It's very, very heavy. Just rumbled. What do you want me to say? You knew what you were getting into. Really? Well, I'm sorry we don't measure up to your exacting standards, Dr. Collins. Maybe you just need to give us ordinary humans a break. What? Ordinary humans like Lizzie Graves? Did you really think that I wouldn't find out? Frank told me. Or did you forget there's one person in this shithole who actually talks to me? Kate, it was just a dream. Don't bother, Stephen! Oh, for Christ's sake. Kate, slow down. You were engaged to her, Stephen. You nearly married oh, her. Oh, come on, it was just a drink. Then why the hell did you lie to me about because it? Because I knew you'd be mad and then it would end up in a row. You wanted to focus on the event tonight. Oh, so you were actually doing me a favor. Wow, I guess I just forgot to say thank you. Do not treat me like I'm an idiot. You're overreacting. I know, I know you're stressed. Just... You keep away from me tonight. I'm not gonna let you ruin this for me. Kate. Kate, come on, this is crazy. <laughs> Good to see you, Paul Irvin. Kate. Wait, wait. Oh, it's trying to break through again. Kate. 
here before. I can I get through that gate? Is that it? <laughs> Definitely been here before. Pressure in my eyes again. I can't move my legs, can't feel my face. When I collapsed, the light was waiting for me there. Caught me, lowered me here. Now it's pooling around my feet, watching me. The printers are spewing out page after page of zeros. It's frightened, too. It'll be okay. Be lost. Jesus. 
Jesus, man, what do you dent your face? It's nothing. You collecting feed? Looks like the supplies have been coming in. Huh. Again? The phones are all strange. I can't pinpoint the logic of transmission. You what? What are you doing with that paint? Means the EMC are actually moving at the proper speed. Listen, Frank. Have you uh, heard anything on the radio about a flu outbreak? Doesn't seem much like flu to me. They're shutting down access to the valley to try and isolate it. No. Something about the phones. I can't put my finger on it quite yet. What are you talking about? Hey, I'm still talking to you. Where are you going? This is Catherine Collins, recording for posterity. It's all over. I don't know how long I've got. Whatever he did, whatever the planes were carrying, it's burning my lungs. Probably some kind of nerve agent. I suspect it's only exposure to the pattern that has kept me alive this long. I'm making my way to Tower 6. I'm going to fuse the signals from the optical array. I just... can make it. Have they closed the tunnel? There's no trains. I've put up a sign. The tunnel, Howard. Is it closed? I think so. I don't like it. It's not right at all. Stop whining. It doesn't help anyone. Did you know you're bleeding? Oh, it's this headache. It's just killing me. I haven't had a nosebleed like this since I was a kid. But you've not been to the village? No, I've been here the last couple of days or at home. I've only spoken to Clive at the EMC on the phone. Well, tried to anyway, but with all the crossed lines... It... But no direct contact with any other people? No, no one. What are you talking about? What's going on? It's the pattern. It's adapted again. It doesn't need direct contact to transfer. It's using the phones. What do you mean, direct contact, Stephen?
follow that damn bitch just to say he's a cheat. Seen it. They do, though. You're overreacting. Steven, they stare at me. <laughs> Yesterday, I went into the village, and this old woman just stopped in the middle of the street and stared at me like I had two heads. Oh, don't be so melodramatic. <laughs> I'm like a walking freak show. Oh, this place. It's so insular. I just don't understand how you grew up here. Well, I was very different then. And they're not so bad, really. That's easy for you to say. Just give it a bloody chance, Kate. This was the deal. A year here, and we could be in with a real shot at Lucia. Stephen! Oh, Christ, it's Lantham. Stephen Appleton, I thought it was you. What's all this about a young wife? Oh, um, hello. Two heads, Stephen. Hi, I'm Kate. and jump back on uh, in just two minutes. See if I can fix the game. Cheers for tuning in everybody and I'll hopefully see you again very soon. Bye. 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 <laughs>